I recently did a video picking open a Morty sleeve lock and somebody commented saying they still don't understand what false gates are and how they work. So I said I'll do another video just going through it again. Now I have done this in the past, but I'm gonna to try to do this as clear and as simple as possible. I've stripped two locks apart and I'm gonna explain exactly how false gates work and what they are. Now, first of all, a false gate or an anti-pick notch is the same. Basically, it's just something to trap the bolt. So when you're picking the levers up, it traps the bolt so you can't get the lock open. And this one here is out of an ERA. It's got a little tiny notch in there. That's an anti-pick notch, but again, you can call it a false gate. Now this is the bolt out of that lock. So when you're picking the levers up, obviously the aim is to get the bolt to go through the true gate. So when you pick all the five levers up, the bolt slides through all the five levers and it gets you the open. They can slip into anti-pick notches or false gates. So that little nick there, I'm just gonna put it over there so you can see it. That little nick there will get caught in that groove on the bolt. Once it gets caught, it's jammed. You can't lift the lever up anymore. So obviously you can't get the lock open. So that's an anti-pick notch. It gets trapped in there and it prevents you getting it open. Obviously you wanna lift past that anti-pick notch and go through the true gate to get that lock open. Now this one is out of a merchant hardware and it's exactly the same principle. I'm just gonna pick this lever up because this lever has got two false gates or anti-pick notches. One at the top, one at the bottom. So again, when you're picking this lock, the aim is to get through the true gate. If you get caught in that, again, it's gonna lock up, you're not gonna get it open. And if you manage to pick past that one and then go two eye, it's gonna catch in the bottom one. And again, you're not gonna get the lock open. So these are anti-pick notches or false gates in lever locks. Hopefully that's cleared it up. That's it for now. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Try a bit.